One of the biggest challenges when trying to impress recruiters or potential employers in data analytics and data science is showing our skills and what we can offer. Creating a portfolio of projects is often done to demonstrate different tools and analytics methods and show that we are ready to be hired. However, to get a job as a data analyst or a data scientist, you need to showcase many technical skills, including data visualization, statistics, a bit of coding and communication skills. And well, it is difficult to put all of this in one place. And so what I see all the time is that you might provide in your resumes one link for a Tableau dashboard that you made, maybe a different link to your GitHub space where some coding projects are stored, and maybe even a different link to your Google Drive where you have an Excel spreadsheet or a presentation. And so the more projects you have and the more this becomes a mess. And by now you might ask yourself, so what? Ciao guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Lore, and my goal here is to make you land a job in data in the easiest and most effective way. And this is why I want to show you probably the best tool I found to create your data portfolio in just a few clicks. And best of all, completely for free. And so let me introduce you to datascienceportfolio.io. They are kindly sponsoring this video and the reason for that is that I genuinely believe this tool is amazing and super powerful. And the most effective way to demonstrate this to you is by showing you what you can do with it. And so if any of this sounds interesting, let's now create our data portfolio from scratch in just a few clicks. All right, so first thing first, we're gonna type in data science portfolio on Google and you should be able to see one of the first results is this one here and this is datascienceportfolio.io we can click on create your portfolio and now we just have to um, sign up so i'm gonna type in my email and my password and then i'm gonna click on uh, sign up and now we just have to uh, create our own portfolio link so again here i'm gonna type laura so what and click on save and this is the space where we're gonna input all the information about ourselves and our projects okay so now we're gonna start adding information about our profile so i'm gonna add my uh, profile picture i'm gonna put my uh, name in this case name of the channel laura so what i'm gonna add the headline which might be your current role so in this case i'm gonna put data analytics lead at amazon i'm gonna put my location so i'm gonna keep london um, uk and then i can also fill up my technical skills so in this case, um, I can write something like SQL, uh, Python, um, Excel, and so on. Make sure to uh, leave a comma in between the skills, and I'm gonna show you why in a second. This is just for the, the format of the, the final portfolio. And then also you have space here for your social contact. So this can be um, links to, for example, your LinkedIn, or you know any social that you have. In my case, I will add my Medium profile. So I'm gonna add my link here and then I'm gonna click on save. And this is how the my profile will uh, look like at the moment. Now is the next step. We're gonna add our experience uh, in case you have it. So I'm gonna add, for example, dates 2023. I'm gonna add my role. And again, I can write the skills that are specific to uh, this, this experience. And then obviously, if you have multiple experience, maybe in different companies, you can add more experience here. So I'm gonna add my previous experience prior to Amazon as a data analyst at Deloitte. And I'm gonna follow the same process. So adding the uh, description and also the, the skills and click on uh, save. And then what I'm gonna do is also adding uh, my education. So we have a space uh, specific to that. Okay, and so now the juicy part, we're gonna add our uh, projects. So one project that I can add here is the uh, COVID-19 uh, global vaccination tracker that I made in Tableau. Um, so I'm gonna also write the description and the skills here are Tableau, um, data visualization and statistics. I can also add a, a picture of the, of the project um, by the way, this is a project that uh, I'm gonna link here at the top of the screen that you can recreate uh, in a step-by-step -step guide that I uh, made. And so yeah, you just crop the image and then um, you can click on save and um, also in click on done and this is how the project will look like. 
Now what we can do if we click on project, we can actually um, edit the, the project to add a bit more information. So in this case, you see there is a text box where we can add image, uh, bullet points, um, even links and uh, the code that we used. So in my case, I will just describe a bit more in details the, the dashboards and then I'm going to click on save and then done. And so as you can see, you have this read more section where you can see more, more details. Okay, and so I just went ahead and added a bit more information and now we can click on visit your portfolio to actually see what uh, other people will see when clicking on our portfolio link. And so in this case, as you can see, I have my uh, profile picture, my name, my current role, my location, different links, so my Medium, LinkedIn, uh, GitHub, Kaggle and also a space to email me directly. You have the about section and also the list of uh, my main skills. I've added a few more uh, projects and details. Uh, so, you know, if um, if I want to check the, for example, the details about the uh, global vaccination tracker, I can click on read more. And then, as you can see here, a bit more details, the actual preview of the, the dashboard. Um, and then if we go back, uh, you know, we can do the same for the projects and then you have the experience and then the education. So I'm not sure what you think guys, but uh, you know, I've done this in uh, maybe less than 10 minutes and to me, this looks super good actually. And now another feature about this platform is that I can click on these explore projects on the top right. And from here, I can actually see projects that were done by other people. And also what you can do is um, in case you need inspiration, for example, for a Python project, then you can click here on Python and you will see only projects that are uh, using Python. And so again, powerful tool for you to um, get inspiration and also connect with uh, other people. And well, this is it guys. We just made a professional and good looking data portfolio that we can now share with recruiters or potential employees to showcase all our skills in one place only and all of this completely for free. Be sure to check out datascienceportfolio.io and start building your own data portfolio today. I will leave here in the screen some other videos that I made on how to recreate some of my best data projects and you can just follow those step by step and you can also add those in your own data portfolio. As always, if this video was valuable to you, make sure to like and subscribe for more content like this. As you know, this will massively help the channel and well, enjoy the rest of your day. Ciao for now and see you in the next one.